This is the Murray Family Cemetery, located off of Highway 490 in East Bernstadt. You turn right on the Murray Cemetery Road, just a little past Hazel Green School. In the mid-1930s, up until around 1940, a young couple by the name of Robert Helton, age 35, and his wife Ethel, age 31, we're starting a family down here in this end of the county. In 1940, they had a six-year-old son. They had two daughters. One was two and a half. The other was about 14 months old. And it's not clear whether Ethel had had her son yet. She had another son born in 1940. And I don't know in May of 1940 whether she had already had that child or whether she was expecting. But 1940 would turn out to be a year for them to celebrate a new child, but also a year of extreme tragedy. Around the Helton household in the summer of 1940, they were having problems with mice. And they came up with the idea to poison the mice by mixing rat poison up and making some biscuits and then proceeding to hide those biscuits behind furniture and other items so that the mice would find them. Sometime during the middle of the night, that's exactly what happened. The mice found them, but they also pulled them out into the open. And the next morning, before anyone knew it, tragedy occurred. Two young girls got out of bed that morning and scampering around the house and found those poison biscuits. And before anyone had any clue, they had ingested them and the tragedy occurred. On May the 29th of 1940, Mary Jane Hilton passed away from rat poisoning at the age of two years and five months and 16 days. And three days later, on June the 1st, her little sister, Louise, age one year, two months, and 21 days also passed away after having ingested the rat poison biscuits. At some point, Robert and Ethel Helton relocated to Butler County, Ohio in Hamilton where they lived out the remaining years of their lives as well as several of their children. And they are buried in the Hamilton area now. But here at the Murray Cemetery in East Bernstadt, resting in peace, are sisters Mary Jane and Louise, who lost their lives May the 29th of 1940 and June the 1st of 1940, resting in peace here at the Murray Cemetery.